The carburetor system could get asked on your private pilot check ride. Let's break it down. The carburetor mixes fuel and air before it enters the engine. It uses the Venturi effect. As air speeds up as it goes through a narrower throat, pressure drops and fuel is drawn in. Think of this like a garden hose. If you put your thumb over the garden hose, the water speeds up and the water goes further. It's the same thing, except instead of water, we're thinking of air being pulled through the Venturi. The mixture control allows us to fine tune how much fuel is going into the system because as you increase in elevation, you have to lean the mixture out so we have the same fuel to air mixture. We have to worry about carb icing because in the Venturi tube, a drop in static pressure also causes a drop in temperature. So as the air speeds up, it can drop up to 60 degrees Fahrenheit, which is why we have to worry about carb icing in up to 70 degrees Fahrenheit. Carb icing is most noticeable in 20 degrees up to 70 degrees Fahrenheit. And you notice this by a rough running engine, you turn on the carb heat, Notice a drop in RPM, that's the first reaction before it eventually gets better. You notice a drop in RPM because now the fuel to air mixture is warmer than it was before because of the carb heat. Warm air is less dense and we all know that less dense air means worse performance on the engine. Let me know in the comments if this made sense.